Yo, I got a fun one here. This is a power inverter for a, a Nissan Aria. One of those EV jobbies. This one here went bad. If you need to buy one of these hunks of junkers, it's gonna set you back about $5,000. I figured it'd be a good piece to scrap out. There's no core on these things when you buy them and nobody rebuilds them either. So it's basically worthless. So I'm gonna see what kind of value I can get out of this thing, taking it all apart. There should be some aluminum, some copper, some circuit boards in here. I see there's some pins right here, some alignment pins. They're not magnetic, so they're probably stainless steel. I'm gonna get those out of here. Let's use a claw hammer. It come right out like that. Whole bunch of 10 millimeters. Looking like some T20 torches on here too. Little bit of steel. Oh, found some more 10 millimeters. Well, I think I got all the screws out of this thing and it won't come apart. I can see there's some black glue back in here. I think this thing's all glued together. So I'm just gonna try to pry this thing out of here. I'm sure I'll break it. That's okay. It's a $5,000 piece of junk at this point. Oh yeah, I'm getting somewhere. Yeah. Oh, look at that. All kinds of copper. I don't see too much gold in here. Looks like some pretty low grade circuit boards. So, this here's a nice chunk of aluminum. Looks like I can try to get a whole bunch of copper out of this thing. I think these power strips are pretty low grade. They don't look like there's any gold in these. I thought I'd see some gold in here for $5,000. This thing should be made of gold. There's not even any gold pins in it. Temperature sensor of some kind. Get some Phillips screws after these circuit boards. Yeah, these circuit boards definitely look like some Cheap, low-grade junk. Yeah, low-grade boards are worth a couple bucks a pound. Or 25 cents. That's about it. What's up with this deal? Looks like I got some T27 torches all over the place. Four millimeter Allen's all over the place. Found some T20s in here. Those weren't cooperating. Gee, I wonder what's in that. Wow. That's a nice big 150 amp fuse in here. I thought it'd be a little easier for me to get at all this copper. That must be a capacitor of some kind. I'm guessing. I better make sure it's discharged so I don't get shocked and die. Wow. They sure do make it hard to get at all this copper. That's all solid copper. I just gotta figure out how to separate it from all this plastic.
more low grade junk. It's got a nice aluminum heat sink on it if I can separate that. That's good aluminum. Another aluminum heat sink. There's coolant that runs through here. Try to separate this. Nope. Give me my aluminum. I want. It's fun destroying a $5,000 piece of junk for 20 cents of aluminum. Makes it all worthwhile, you know? Ooh, there's some goodies in here. What's what's going on in here? Ooh. We got all kinds of copper and stuff. You don't make this very easy to recycle, that's for sure. What am I gonna do with that? Just when I thought I had a good idea. All kinds of uh, copper embedded in plastic everywhere. Jeez, I can't tell if that's gold in there or what. This all looks like um, plastic with impregnated aluminum in it. I don't know why there's Torx bits on here. Oh, little piece of aluminum with an O-ring on it. They must have used these for a heat sink of some kind. There's no more copper on that. So that looks like a big piece of plastic junk. Another low-grade circuit board with almost nothing on it. I'm going to separate this circuit from this plastic somehow. Okay, I'm winning. Yep, low-grade circuit board. I thought there'd be like a whole bunch of weight and copper in this thing, and it's all just chintzy, chintzy, chintzy. Time for some safety glasses and ear protection. get the vice after this thing. Ooh, copper. I don't know if I want to wreck this capacitor or whatever it is. Maybe some know-it-all in the comment section can tell me what this thing is. I say capacitor. There's some micro farad numbers on here. So what do I do? I want the copper. Jeez, I wonder if there's any value in this, this fuse. It says it's a good fuse. I've been looking at this fuse. I looked it up. They're like they're like $55. I think these ends are all silver on here. This might have some value to it. I don't know. Does any of you people know anything about these things? It might be silver. How can I sell it? Well, I got one piece of copper that came off nice and easy for me. What about the rest of this? I wonder if this capacitor has value. Not anymore. I can't wait to see somebody in the comments section tell me how stupid I am for doing this. I just might have wrecked something that was expensive. It looks like a bunch of cheesy junk to me. I got all the little bits of copper and aluminum and other stupidity separated. These, when I thought I'd find some value in this thing, I was badly mistaken. 
I thought I was going to run into a little miniature gold mine looking at all this copper sticking out of the thing. <laughs> One pound, 3.6 ounces of copper. So that's about four bucks. Seven pounds, seven ounces of aluminum. I tried to separate the board from this thing and uh, I probably tried too hard to do that. Low grade circuit boards, seven ounces. So 12 cents. That's pretty much all the value I got. I got this copper strip here. I don't, I don't think that's worth anything. Well, that was fun anyways. That's my video. Okay, bye.